hey guys what's up and welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here my name is alicia so today i'm doing a updated review on this insta mini 8 camera um, i bought this camera a couple years ago i actually got it for christmas on the previous video i made i still have a lot of questions and comments about um this camera so i decided to do an updated review on it so yeah the biggest question i get is how do i fix the all lights flashing of uh, the all blinking lights and good question because mine started doing it again so if i press this button here to pop it out and you can see mine is doing the all lights blinking thingy again can y'all see that so um, i'm gonna show you how to fix that again so yeah here we go so yeah as you can tell that the all lights are blinking right here um so let's see have batteries in it and it's still all lights blinking. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna push this back in and I'm gonna try to put in fresh batteries. So I think that is what does the trick. Fresh set of batteries here. And let's see, which way does this go? I think this goes like this. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, here we go. And look at there, I just put the batteries in and you see it automatically came out. So, and as you can tell, there is no more lights blinking. See, no more lights blinking. All I did was put a fresh set of batteries in it so it still works after a while um i guess that's the way of letting you know that the batteries need to be changed so it just starts blinking and then yeah i can turn and maneuver whatever settings i want to do and so i'm gonna take a picture of my old my new instax mini if you haven't seen this video i have it linked i don't i'm not sure if it's gonna go up before i do this updated video or after but um, yeah, I have it somewhere linked if it isn't if it's up already. So I'm gonna take a picture of this You can see it is coming out now look at that It's working as intended So yeah again, that's how you fix the owl lights blinking for my camera. That's what I do to um, get the lights to stop blinking like that. It just means the battery needs to be replaced. So all I did, as y'all saw, is just took out these old batteries and put these new batteries in. So yeah. So because I fixed that now, like I said, I really like this camera. Um, besides the little all lights blinking thing, it's kind of annoying. Uh, but besides that, I still like this camera. But I did want to get an updated one because the differences between the Insta mini 8 and the insta mini 11 is the mini 11 has a little uh mirror in the front so you can take a selfie with so um that is the main difference between these two i see so this is the mini insta 11 and this is the 8. you see the 11 has a little mini um mirror on it so yeah put them side by side like this you can clearly see that the the older one the mini 8 is a little bit i think it's a little bit thicker um then this one so you see this one is kind of bulkier than this but you still kind of got the same framework you got the flash right here um the only difference i've seen is that you know how you can turn like the different settings if you want to do it if you wanted to do it inside or outside you have the different settings right there you don't see that on this one you don't see that one on this one so when i pop this out and turn it on all you see is this little thing right there that says um selfie mode so that's the biggest difference I see so far. Um, but you still have like the, the shutter button right there and the viewfinder is still on the right hand side. Push both of these in, flip them over. Still kind of the same framework and setup. But like I said, the newer one, it looks more sleek and more, I, maybe it's the color. <laughs> but yeah, it looks more like friendlier to use because you can take a selfie with it. You can do all of the above. So yeah, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna try to test out, see which one of them comes, you know, clearer or faster when um, printing out the film. So I'm gonna take a both, both pictures. Let's pop these out. 
both pictures of this phone case to see which one of them comes out quicker. Okay, let's see if I can zoom my hand to do both of them at the same time. All right, ready and we're snapping. I think we got both of them snapped at the same time. Here we go. So they both finish at the same time. So um, it's not saying that the new one is better. <laughs> they both finish at the same time. So I'm just gonna take both of the films out. So this film goes with this camera and this one with this camera. So let's see what it look like. But yeah, you can just see how high this one sits up and how, you know what I'm saying? So um, yeah, I just wanted to, like I said, this one still works. And it still does great things, but this one has a little mirror in the front. Like, how can you not, you know, how can you beat that? <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm just going to push both of them in. And as you can see, that turns it off. But, yeah, that was uh, the comparison of them two. So, let's see how this one works. Ah, they wouldn't focus on the same thing, but you can see the color is starting to come in a little bit quicker on the newer one than it is on the older one right here. So the newer one is developing a whole lot quicker than this one. But I do think they both still use the same film um, size, so I don't think it's no difference with the film because um, they both still look like the same size, but this one is developing a whole lot faster than um, the older one so that's another difference I guess we can note and take down I know they have an Insta Mini 9 but um, that wasn't the latest one like I said I wanted the latest and greatest one just like this one but an upgrade of it so yeah so that's one of the main differences I see so far so besides the color and the look of it um, yeah these are the differences that I see but again like I said um, if you have the all lights linking and you got the Insta Mini 8 just put fresh batteries in it. That worked for me. I'm pretty sure it'll work for you. And yeah. please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button and i'll see y'all in my next video